This is a video tutorial that shows you how to use membership criteria in Adaptive Release. There are times you might want to make an item available to one group but not to the other. This can be done using grouping and Adaptive Release. In this trial course, I have two groups. They are Group 1 and Group 2. In Group 1, I have BB Student 11. In Group 2, I have BB Student 12. Assuming I want to make this item to be available to group 1 only, I will go to the adaptive, the adaptive release of this item. Under the membership, I will select group 1 to the right hand side. Once I'm done, I will click on the submit button. And you should see a message enable adaptive release. Although as a tutor, you will see this, this item, but students from group 2 will not be able to see this item. Whereas students from group 1 will be able to see this item. In this laptop, I have two browser login as student. One of the browser I log in as BB Student Shelf. And that student would, is not able to see the item. In another browser where I log in as BB Student 11, is able to see this item. That's how we use membership criteria in Adaptive Release.